Hey there, this is Ryan Thomas with Bolt Line Rental. I just wanted to show you how we prep our trucks and kind of the evolution of it. Um, we have this reading crate with some of our standard grip gear in there. This crate is the same every time it goes out, so it has to be fully checked just to make sure everything is in there. Um, we started out doing just what everybody else was doing. We'd, we'd look at a list and we'd check off the items one by one. Um, this video of Matt attempting each method is really best case scenario because he actually has the list memorized. Um, what it was what is in this crate at this point. Um, we started doing this bag of pins, um, you'll see right there, that we zip tied closed. That way if it came back and it was still sealed, we wouldn't have to check it. We just know it's all in there. Um, and this is really our first method we used for years. The issue with it was that the metal milk crate liner made it really hard for us to scan all of our RFID tags and there just wasn't enough organization. Um, you'd had to dump out the entire crate to count everything easily. So it was a minute 33 seconds and you know just keep in mind that's best case scenario because Matt is not looking at a list here. Um, so next we actually used our milk crate dividers and milk crate liners that we created. Um, I'll link them in the description so you can check them out. Since they're not made of metal the RFID tags work great with them and now we don't have to dump the entire crate out to count everything um, but we're still finding a lot of excess motion as we're moving items around to count everything. Um, still like also some over processing with the uh, the pin bag is it doesn't really add any value to the customer and if anything it just made them upset they had to cut off a zip tie every time they used it. So here's the last iteration um, from 1 minute 20 seconds to roughly 7 seconds to count everything. Uh, we moved a couple items like the safety chains away from this crate, but you can see huge improvement already. Um, we used this two drawer crate case from Studio Carts and some Kaizen foam from FastCap. And uh, now all you have to do is open the drawers, look for empty spaces, and then you can go back to your list and cross off an entire section without much thought. So, uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any ideas of your own, let us know. We're always trying to improve. Thank you.